Welcome back. This is Beauty Rick. Today we have we have a hobby box of 21, 22 SBA. You may notice today is the first video without Seth. Anyone who didn't watch the video where we announced it, Seth won't be in any new videos for the for the next little while. So now on to the video. So so now the, the configurations for this year's SBA is nine cards per pack, pack and ten packs per box. It's a different configuration from the previous years. You'll get you'll get at least one autograph future watch, future watch rookie per box and one other auto on average. So let's get into this and hope we pull a banger. I know I I know this product is hit, hit this product is pretty hit or miss. So let's hope we can pull something good. So so let's get at it. So in my opinion, we we still get the same still the same amount of future watch autos and stuff. So. This 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 configuration could be pretty cool. So let's get at it, and we'll see what inserts and other cards we get. I finally got. So this is this is the configuration of the of, of the base. In my opinion, it looks pretty pretty good, and that's the back of the card. So comment what you think of of this year's design in the comments. Okay, we're going to save this. This pack has a future watch auto. You wanna say, are you going to say the names like Seth? Or? We don't say the names much anymore. It's more like the 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 Legends video because it's like players, players you don't usually see. This is like all normal yeah. players. So we, we have a limited future watch. This is, this is a new card this year, it looks like. It's of Jake Neighbors. He's he's a pretty decent prospect. And we also have a a Spectrum FX future watch of Cole Lind, for ex Vancouver Canuck, now prospect in the Seattle Kraken system. And we have Cole C Sillinger, SP top rookie. He's a pretty pretty good young top rookie young player in, in the NHL. So, let's continue to hope we get some good cards here, and hope that Future Watch Auto is really good. So, Seth Jones, we, Seth's favorite player, and we have our boy, Brock Besser. It's always nice when you get a Brock card. And there's Petey, who, who I think will probably get si signed in his big extension this summer. There's Matthews. We're, we we are wondering if he he's gonna be gonna if if his Leafs are gonna be able to win the series. They're currently leading three one at the time of this recording, and we have a limited of Alexander Ovechkin. Ovechkin this year broke Gordy Howe's goal record and has, has, and has over eight of eight hundred two goals. So that was pretty impressive to see. And we have a limited future watch of number to ninety nine. So this is a pretty rare card. Of Scott Perunovic, Scott Perunovic on the Blues. He's a defenseman, and we have Roman Leosi True Leaders. So honestly, it's nice that we get like three inches per pack, because before you would only get like one inches per pack. Carter Hellebuck. Oh, there's our boy Sid, the captain, of the captain of the Pittsburgh Penguins. Their team missed the playoffs, but it, it wasn't because of Crosby missed the playoffs because he, he had he had 93 points, which is in his age 35 season. So it wasn't Crosby's fault they missed. So hopefully they can be back in it next year. Wrong pile. We have a limited of Victor Olsson. It's This one's hard to pa page entry of Robin Leonard. And a true leader, leaders of Jonathan Tapes. It's pretty unfortunate what, what happened to him this season. So 
and 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 it, it's like he he's not he he he's not he's. I wonder what team he's going to go to if he continues his his career. Former captain of the Seattle Kraken. We have D Boss and Tyler Bertuzzi. Tim Talbot. A limited future watch of Casper Bjornquist on the Penguins. So th these are cool new car cards they have. And we have a, a pageancy, pageancy of Igor Shesterkin. An SB Top Rookies of Matthew Phillips. Is he a top rookie though? Not really. Thomas Hurdle. Elvis. Nico Heaster had a pretty good season. Mac Pacioretty. And we have a uh, this is this is our, this is this is our non future watch auto card. It's a UD Authentics of Cam Akazin. So they're pretty nice auto there, but yeah, but that's a pretty nice card. We have pageancy pageancy of Cole Sillinger, pageancy rookies of Cole Sillinger, and we have a what are these cards called? Deca Cons or something, something like that of Connor McDavid. So this is like the best one you can get of the set. So we have three packs left. Will will we be able to get like a patch card? That'd be nice. We have a Kale McCarr here, one of the best defensemen in the in the in the NHL. Kevin Fiala had a pretty decent season there on the Kings. Ryan O'Reilly, unlimited of you know, Timmy Panarin. Spectrum FX of Kale McCarr and a a Decacon of Leon Drysaito. So nice cards there. The Nuge, he had 100 points, so this is the first time since the 90s that three players hit 100 points, so that's pretty cool. It was pretty cool to see this season. Timmy Panarin, you see, we will not name this player because we sh he shall not be named. Martin Nik 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 Nikas, we have a future, limited future watch of J.K. Bernard Docker on the Sands. And this is this is a really nice card. It's a pageancy pageantry of Marcel Dion, who is one of the greatest players of all time in the NHL. So that's pretty cool to get. And we have SP top rookies of Spencer Knight. So we have two packs left before we reveal what our future auto is. McDavid had one one of the, the best seasons in, in recent history since 1995-96 season. He had like over 150 points, 153 points. So that was really impressive to see. Quinn Hughes, he had he had a pretty good season with the Canucks this season. A limited future watch of Felix Sandstrom. Uh, Pageancy rookie of Ross Colton. And SP top rookies of Bennett Olivia Gr Grill. So now we have our last pack. Will we pull something insane here? Or will it just be a normal pack? We'll see. Looks like we're not getting anything insane here. For like a patch or anything of like that sort. But still. Some. We have a. Uh, Elias Lindholm. 
a limited of Jonathan Marshall show. St a stammer page and see. SB top rookie and an SB top rookies of Kaylin Addison. So now let's reveal our future watch auto. So we have a Tyler Toffoli here. We have a true leaders of Blake Wheeler. We have a page and see of Scott Peronovic and our Future Rush Auto is, who is it going to be? It's uh, Future Rush Auto of Rasmus Kapari. So, not the worst Future Rush Auto to get, but not the best. So, this is like like a pretty decent one. So, 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 I think that, that was not, obviously not getting your value back, but it could have been much worse. So, so this is a recap of our cards. So, we got some pretty nice cards here. This this pageancy of Marcel Dion was pretty nice. Spectrum FX of Kale McCarr. This pa this this Decacons of Leon was pretty nice. This 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 was a really nice one of Connor McDavid Decacons. This is probably our second best card of the break. The UD Authentics of Cam Atkinson. Yeah, this was nice too. The limited feature watch of Scott Peronovic, number to ninety nine. Overall, this break was pretty. It was decent. Not the worst, not the best. So now let's, and of of course, not forgetting this feature watch auto of Rasmus Kapari. So, so yeah. So that was a that. So so that 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 is this year's SBA. So. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, please like, subscribe, and comment down below. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye.